Hey guys, what's up? It's Danny V with Danny V Mobile Home TV. Back again with another video. If you guys like um, watching these uh, new mobile home single wide, double wide videos, please consider subscribing to the channel and you'll get updates every time I upload a new video. So here, today we're at Village Homes in Pine City, Minnesota, and they're an exclusive friendship home dealer. So let's see what we have to offer, or let's see what this home has to offer. Lots of windows in the front. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, counting the small trends of a window. And then we'll let's just go around the home to see what it looks like on the outside. It's got a nice rough pitch. Like the color as well. Of course, you can choose any color that you want, basically, to have it put on the house. Another transom window here, which is cool. You got two of them in the house, it looks like. No, three of them. Here's the back door. Here are two side windows. And a transit window in a mini transit window. Wow, that's pretty sweet. These are these are definitely unique homes. Have more personality and style than the ones than a lot of regular ones that I see. And this one's affordably priced as well. I'll put that price in the and at the end of the video. You guys check out because <laughs> prior rock everything like prices have skyrocketed with inflation and everything like that you guys know that um all right let's come into the house come into the house and these are thick walls too because we're in Minnesota and we're up in the northern part, so it gets pretty cold and pretty cold and windy and stuff like that in the winter time. So you need to have wire walls for insulation. Do a pan around here. And right here is obviously where you put your entertainment stand, or I mean this is the entertainment stand, you put a TV right here. There's actually a cable right here where you can cable hook up. Very cool. And then down here, here's one of their, one of their flyers. The home is approximately $122,500. That basically includes um, delivery. It just depends on where you live. I mean, that price is not guaranteed. It's going to go up and down just like the price of gas. Very volatile economy right now. So anyways, um, this is, I mean, this lets, out, lets in so much light. You go back here, you've got, even the door has windows in it. So when you shut the door, it probably would still be just as bright in here. Just let's do that. Unfortunately, these homes aren't, don't have any electric hook, hooked up to them, but today you really don't need it. It's not even sunny out and it's still pretty bright in here. And you've got a nice, you could, you could do a lot of stuff with this area right here. Yeah, you could have a, you could have a computer here. You have some chairs. You got a lot of electrical outlets here. You've got three of them just, just on this, um, Stand alone. And then, yes, we've got a gas range. You know, <laughs> they're talking about banning gas ranges. To me, that is crazy. But, you know, everything's political these days. So yeah, look at these really nice cabinets. They've got a lot of nice cabinets. Plus, 
um, these two huge windows with your sink right by it. I mean, like in other videos, I don't particularly like the sink in the middle island because you've got to do a lot of turning around and stuff like that. Not, not in this one though. Like you've got a big sink and you've got plenty of space to, you know, put your toaster decorations, obviously like right here. Yeah, I really like the, the color of the wood too. On the oven, let's see. I was gonna see, it's a Whirlpool oven. So those are obviously nice quality. Here's a cupboard with um, shelving in it. Put your pots and pans and stuff down there, popcorn maker and whatnot. And then, Here's your cabinet. You've got your range right here that will expel all of the, the cooking smells and stuff like that right out of your house. In most older houses, they, they have it going into the wall and it looks like it's coming out, but it's going out, but it's not. It's just like blowing air right back in your face. So it's, those are kind of fake, but these are actually real. They actually do blow outside. Let's see. That feels like ceramic to me. Doesn't feel doesn't feel cheap or anything. And you know how I love <laughs> I love the vents on the floor over to the side of the house or over to the side. We've got one, two, three, four vents, you know, within a small area right there. That's great. Uh, you don't want to have a vent, you know, say like right in the middle there. Maybe that's just me. I don't know. I find that very annoying. Let's see. And we've got a Whirlpool dishwasher. All these appliances are very economical. And it matches the, it matches the stove, stainless steel. And another cupboard. And then you've got a um, recessed light right there, which is nice. I can just imagine what this would look like at night. It would look really cool. Um, recessed lighting throughout the house. You've got cabinets right here. Cabinets right here. You could put a lot. I mean, you could put a, like, you know, your, uh, like an air pressure cooker, crock pot, whatever up here. The uh, options are endless. And then we got a microwave here, which is also a Whirlpool, which is also high quality. So um, all these appliances will last you a very long time. And it also matches the refrigerator, which is, um, yep, yeah, it's a Whirlpool too. Very nice. And then We've got a cab or cupboard, a drawer, whatever you like to call it right here. Oh, nice, nice. I haven't seen this before in a manufactured home, single white home, mobile home, whatever you want to call it. You could put your pans and dishes and stuff right there. Maybe you want to put some spices there. Lots of different options for that. Very cool. Very, very cool. So, behind me is the master bedroom, so we'll avoid that till the end. We'll save the best for last. And look at this, I like, I really like this. It's uh, wood up here instead of like a cheap, light, you know, light fabric border or whatever. I like that a lot. Looks very, looks a lot nicer. And you've got another, uh, that right there. Very big space for your kitchen table. And then you've got two ceiling lights right there, recessed lights right there. So you've got a good amount of space for a table. And maybe if you were to turn that table, you know, the long way, you can get maybe a buffet or some stuff like that in, in here as well if you have one of those. 
But yeah, so I mean this this has like a a super cool nice porch out here. I didn't really show you guys that yet. Alright, here's the back door with again what's in a lot of white. And this is your electrical box, circuit box right there, circuit breaker. And then here's your your furnace. This Revolve brand must be maybe exclusive to French homes because I haven't seen that one before. For instance, the homes that I've toured and a lot of different ones. Let's see, here's the smaller, the three bedroom. This is a smaller of the three bedroom. But look at the look at the floors. I love the floors. It's all hardwood floors throughout until you get to your master bedroom. But and then um, and here it's hardwood. You got a vent right there. You got the uh, the wood paneling up there again. Makes it look really classy. And I know you guys. You guys like to look at the uh, what you got hidden in in the closets. So you got two shelvings, two two shelves, which is nice because I really don't see shelving in most of them. These doors seem to be seem to be put together pretty well. nice and tight and then we got an area for your washer and dryer and I love the pan the wood paneling on here it looks really cool really really cool it would look very cool if it was throughout the whole house but then I think it'd make the house look smaller but it's cool that they've got accent walls like this in here to make some areas you know to make areas pop got that transit window right here and we got your bathroom right here Hey guys, what's up? What's up guys? Um, here's the lights. Those are cool lights. I've never seen lights like that in a bathroom. So, I mean, all these homes are brand new, I think within at least six months. I mean, probably newer than that because they sell like hotcakes up here. You can buy one right off the lot if you want to, I believe. I mean, that's what's happened with one of them. So I don't see why you couldn't just buy one right off the lot if you really wanted to. Um, but I would call Brianna and uh, ask her about that just to make sure if you're in the area. Okay, here. So here's a second bedroom. Of course, it's going to be a little bigger than the than the third bedroom, the first bedroom I showed you, which has got some nice area in it, and it's got recessed lighting right there. All right, and then. Kind of show you more detail what we got in here. You got this nice big window as well. Nice big thick, thick walls. And there's the classy wood panel. I mean, I don't know guys, I don't know what that's called. Um, maybe if you know, put that in the comments. I don't know what this wood, wood thing up here is called. So. It's not a balance, I don't think. So let me know what that is. Uh, I'm still learning with these videos, what the terminology is. Here's the closet, and this is a very, it's a bigger closet than usual. It's wider than usual. Okay. And then you got your washer dryer hookups, and then, you know, your dryer vent right there. And then, yeah, like I said, look at these wood floors. I love the wood floors. One thing, one, I think it's one of those colors that are timeless that will never go out of style. Tons of lights, tons of lights on the ceiling. I love it. And here's your master bedroom. And you've got a big two window panel up there. Then 
there's there's a vent right there and on, on the other side of the room, on the master bedroom, there's another vent as well. You guys could probably see it right there. And then you got another big accent wall right here with a huge transit window. Looks really nice. I like the accent walls. Look, that looks really modern to me, especially with the white door and the, the white cabinets and and drawers and such out there. Everything matches really nicely. And by the way, I'm not like a salesperson for this dealership or anything like that. They're kind enough to let me come here and video their home so then I can show you new mobile homes that are on the market. So just want to make that clear that I'm not benefiting at all monetarily from this. So I'll have all the links in the description for the dealer's house or the dealer's phone number and their email and website and, and such. So we've got a huge, huge shower. You can a sit down shower, two areas to sit down. And then a transom window above it, which lets in, lets in the natural light. Like there, if there was no window in here, it would be pitch black since there's no lights. But like, look at, look at this right here. You got your um, double sink vanity area. You got his and her sinks and drawers right here and on the side right here this is the this wall right here separates so you have a little privacy there with the toilet and then you got your walk-in closet I don't think there is a closet in that on the, in the master bedroom. I'll look again, but um, in the master bedroom bathroom, there definitely is a big one, and it has a vent too. I've not seen a vent before in my life in a, in a single wide home before. I just haven't, so that's really cool. Lots of unique, different features, and then there's another vent right here. So, I mean, you're not, I don't, I don't imagine you get any like hot or cold spots in this home because there's vents everywhere that would regulate it out really nice. Yeah. So there's no, there's no, uh, oh man, I'm drawing a blank. Um, yeah, there's no you know area to put your clothes or um, closet or whatever in the, in the master bedroom here, but you know the master bathroom makes up for it, anyways. So I would rather have my clothes in there anyways because that's where you change every day when you shower. So I mean this this is the end of this video on this home. I've got a couple more to do at this at this dealership. So so far so good. This is my first one. There's your thermostat. So guys, if you like the video, I would truly appreciate um, if you're not a subscriber, because most of you guys are not subscribers. If you subscribe to the channel, that helps me out immensely. And let me know what you guys think of the home in the comments if you have any questions or anything like that. But from uh, for now, I'll just say goodbye. And thanks for watching the video. Have a great day.